Hello everyone, welcome to another video. Well, I just filmed a few days in my life, take you along, show you what I get up to, or at least some of the things I get up to. You can't really like share your entire life through a 15 minute video. So yeah, that's always something to keep in mind when you look at things on social, any social media platform. It's like a snippet of their lives. So yeah, anyways, today is um, Friday, it's quarter past 10. I had a killer gym session this morning. It was, at, like, I, I'm, <laughs> I still feel honestly like dead. Like, <laughs> I almost felt a bit sick after it. Like, it was, it was, it was gnarly. Gnarly, mate, gnarly. Um, surfing thing. Anyways, just been home, did a few desk jobs. Nothing too interesting. Um, I'm gonna meet a friend for coffee and then I have some exciting things. I've got some errands to do, some presents to buy. So like, just wanna chat a little bit before we like get started on this thing that I've been thinking about recently is that you really, like, I really struggle to hold up the camera. Really, really can, you can have it all. You can have everything that you want in your life. You just have to dedicate times towards it and not stuff around doing stupid things, honestly. Um, honestly, I've also been really thinking about um, what I share on this platform and everything and it's very wholesome full and honest and everything and It was my work like Doing the whole nine-to-five job is Drives me insane because I'm someone who really 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 does not like doing things that I don't want to do because I know it's my life um, and Yeah, but <laughs> I do have to support myself financially so Long story short, please subscribe. I'm wearing, I'm wearing a skirt. How do I zoom in? I can't. But yeah, I'm wearing a skirt and a top. I think in every single other video you've seen me, I was either in swimmers or activewear, which is honestly my favorite thing, but yeah. <laughs> Yeah, this foot really hurts. It's a big issue. I'm balancing on my neutral bullet and I'm just waiting for you to fall over. What do I make, guys? Do I make a smoothie? I'll take you through what I put in my green smoothie. It's very simple. Banana, I'll make sure they're super ripe. And mango, get the big bags when you buy frozen fruit because you're always gonna need the frozen fruit. So just buy the big one, get more bang for your buck. That was not a McDonald's ad. Protein powder, this is the best protein powder I've ever, 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 ever had. It digests fine because it has digestive enzymes in it and it's super clean compared to a lot of the other products that are actually completely overpriced and also really, really bad for your health. Lots of different greens. I'm gonna add that. We'll add the rest of my frozen kale and maybe a bit of spinach. For when you're making a smoothie with like greens in it or leafy stuff. Blend the leafy things or the the leafy things, really, Lily. Oh my gosh. Blend the leaves first into the water or whatever liquid you're using. Um, and then you're gonna get like those chunks of green and they actually gr properly grind up. Shoot! Um, I swear to God, I'm not 12. I'm Alrighty, I just got back from the gym, which is why I look like a mess. I sweat right now, which is not the best feeling. Two PRs on Sumo Deadlifts, I'm quite happy with that. I actually felt sick. <laughs> Sometimes I train so hard that I actually feel sick um, during the workout. Kind of like normal if you train really, really hard, your body struggles to cope. Um, anyways, I'm also struggling to hold up the camera right now. I just wanted to show you my shoes. I've had them for a while. I've kept them um, nice and clean. But yeah, how freaking cool are they? So unique. Like, there's no way anyone's gonna find a pattern like this. Love them. Love them! Quite a few little things to do today. It's already like one o'clock, but that's okay. We're gonna be productive and efficient with our time. Um, but all in all, it's gonna be a good day. Also, um, I did a massive tidy up uh, yesterday and a little bit this morning before I headed up out. And it's just so relieving because it's like, oh, you know, of all the things I have to do, none of them are the little like house cleany jobs, which I really despise, but definitely helps me stay organized. Because if my space personally, and a lot of other people feel like this too, if my space is not clean and tidy, I feel like my head is not clean and tidy. Like it doesn't take that long to clean up. Like just give yourself like, set a 10 minute timer or 20 minute timer. Just like, okay, I'm gonna clean the house in all of my areas. And you will do it all. Like, it actually doesn't take very long. I am starting the 75 day challenge, this TikTok thing. You exercise for 45 minutes twice a day. One of them has to be outside. I exercise for about an hour 45 in the gym or an hour and a half, I can't remember. 
But yeah, I will exercise outside as well. Uh, you read 10 pages of like an entrepreneur or self-help book. You drink 10 gallons of water. Something like that. Anyways, you guys have probably heard of it. Anyways, I'm, I'm going to do it. Not that like um, I don't already do many of those things. But I definitely don't train outside every day. And I definitely don't read every single day. Um, and I have no clue how much water I drink. I probably drink more than 10 gallons of water, honestly. Or one gallon. I can't remember. I don't know gallons, okay? I know liters. I'm Australian. Well, that's a bit bright. I don't know if I like this camera, but I mean, like, I already brought it, so... We're just gonna have to deal with it. But I feel like it does do a bit too much of, like, overexposure. Like, almost as if my face is edited, even though it's not. Ooh! Perhaps, <laughs> yes. Um, I just got back from the gym. I'm actually... I'm actually dead. So, I had the cutest outfit on today. It just was so matchy matchy. I had, oh, I can't stand. But yeah, come on, Lily, she's standing. This white um, gym shop sports bra with the Apex leggings. And then I had like the matching, um, I didn't even mean to color coordinate it, but I had these blue and white vans. So, yeah. When I do legs, I like try to um, either focus on hammies and glutes or quads and glutes. Um, in terms of like accessories and what kind of like major movements I do. I'm really struggling to talk to the camera right now because I'm super tired. Like I'm just like completely burnt out. Old guy. See, I see him every morning when I train at the time that I did this morning. He was like, you train like so hard. Like no one else trains like you. And I was like, thanks. <laughs> um, so that was really sweet. And then he was like, no, seriously. Like I don't see anyone else training like that. Like you try really hard. And I was like, mm-hmm. And he's like, how long have you been lifting for? And I was like, mm, since like March or something. He's like, oh, damn. So, yeah, it was nice to get that compliment, honestly. Like, giving compliments to strangers can be like one of the nicest things ever. So, I'm going to go give a compliment to a stranger today. That's better lighting. Why didn't I film like this? Okay, literally time for a shower. I'm dead. Okay, um, so I just got home obviously um i've cooled down quite a bit because i walked I did a good cool down like a running cool down um and where's my roller i need my roller I'll roll out a bit and talk to you guys at the same time okay so run was good um honestly i shouldn't be running at the moment and if my friends are watching this, you're going to be like, yep, there's classic Lily again doing things that she shouldn't do. Because my ankle now really hurts. Um, there's definitely an issue still with it. I'm actually getting an MRI tomorrow. And I'm seeing an orthopedic surgeon the day after. One, two, three killer sprints. And when I say they were killer, I peed myself three times because it was just that hard like I really pushed myself to the brim TMI TMI yep there you go I peed myself so much but I'm one of those people that I just don't give a shit what other people think because in my opinion the opinion that you have on yourself is the most important and it's not like I'm trying to impress my work boss or my work manager or something I'm just trying to be the best that I can be and if that means I'm gonna pee myself in doing so well then so it is. To the park and did um, some push-ups and a little bit more um, and did like a cool down run and I actually spoke to my friend a little bit for the last five minutes during the cool down like run walk run walk run walk um, more like jog walk jog walk jog walk. And you get so much out of exercising outside. Oh man I'm so dead like I did PRs on sumo deadlifts along with a killer leg day. I think I feel the I filmed this morning. And I said I felt sick during my workout and I beat myself today. <sighs> but you gotta really push yourself to the limits if you want to be the best you can be. I'm not working towards a triathlon or anything because I if I did that my ankle might break. What did I get out of that? What I really got out of my run today was if you really want something, you really have to work for it. And people hear that all day, but they don't actually work towards it. They don't actually put in the required effort to be, you know, the best of the best in that realm of whatever it may be. Um, and you're a night owl, which is pretty rare because 
like genetically speaking through evolution most of us should be morning people like you should be getting up early and you should be you know having these prime hours and just grinding it out and you know in your down time you know spend it with friends and family but don't spend it partying and smoking and drinking and all these they're stupid things oh my god morning routines they're all over the internet all these girls giving these morning routines of this skincare that uh coffee blah 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 and it's like first of all i don't give a shit and second of all morning routines are just stupid i'm sorry in terms of elevating yourself to the best that you can be their morning routines are not going to be beneficial for your view. If you want to learn more, read The 5am Club by Robin Sharma. If you want like some actual like, beneficial advice, sorry. I'm so precious. Oh my god, just stop wasting it, please. Stop wasting it online. If you're... Actually, there's this video. I'm going to get it up on my phone right now. It's... um. Ago, I got this tattoo and it says 60 seconds and I'm gonna tell you why I got it it's because someone asked me a question and I didn't like the answer they said Lauren what would you do if you found out that you only had 60 seconds left to live would you have any regrets about your life would you wish that you had done anything different and I said yes even though that question is scary it's important to ask because you don't want to get to the end of your life, whenever that might be, and regret not chasing that dream of yours, regret not telling that person that you love them. You don't want to have any regrets, right? Life is short and it is fleeting. Stop wasting it pretending to be someone you're not. Stop wasting it being scared and not living your life to the fullest because if you only had 60 seconds left, there's no going back. party person and I always wondered like what is wrong with me why am I not interested in that and everything but it's because from such a young age that I just I just knew that I wanted to spend my time doing other things and I wanted to spend my time being productive and working towards my goals and you know in my downtime to rest I didn't want to go party I wanted to see my friends but I didn't want to party and get drunk and do stupid things I didn't want to. I'm not going to. Take going for work, to work for example. Going to work for me is something that I don't want to do, but if you look at the big picture, it is something I want to do because it's getting me income. Studying is something like you don't want to do. It's not that you don't want to do it, because studying is going to, you know, get you that degree that you want. You just gotta change your opinion and outlook on things and just realize how fucking grateful you are as well. A heap of, oh my gosh, I actually look like a mess. There's a heap of deep chats. I think that's enough for right now. Hello guys, um, it's now the next day. I've had a busy day, I had work um, and then gym and then working on you know my social media stuff a little bit. Actually, I am so tired right now. But we gotta get that second workout in. Mm. Pop you on the bed. Oh, there we go. Look, that'll just have to do for right now. Yeah, I just had work, trained, did a good push day, got some PRs on bench press, which is just nice. And then I worked on my social media a bit, and then I trained again, which was something I really was not, did not want to do, but. Thankful that I did it. I walked, I did some abs, and then I did a little bit of a jog and some two really like uphill sprints, which is nice. It's not good for my foot, so in terms of that, it's not nice. I am getting ready for my Q scan appointment of my ankle looking like this, which is definitely not ideal, but that's okay. After the Q scan appointment, I'm actually have dinner with um my boyfriend shows like you can enjoy life 
um, whilst really working your ass off too. Like when I train, I train to the best of my ability. It, I don't half ass it, you know, I work. I study, I work on my side hustle as well, I do all these things, but I also will make the time, you know, to quote unquote enjoy life, um, spend time with friends and family and people that are important to me. Alright, my Uber's on its way, um, but I thought I'd show you my dress. I'm also someone who doesn't wear makeup, like, at all. In fact, I'm not even wearing any foundation at all right now. Just a little bit of eyes, a little bit of lippy, tiny bit of mascara. In fact, my mascara's running out too much. Minutes. Shit, I gotta go. Okay, bye. How the hell did... Why did I just like that? That's gross. Oh my god. I like cut my face somehow. So, I saw a surgeon today. And, very short, scar tissue built up, but not only did the scar tissue built up, build up in the back of my ankle joint, it's also really inflamed. <laughs> like, there's a lot of water in it. The problem is the FHL tendon, which I've explained in another video, goes from here up to the back here. And at one point, that along the tendon, it's very inflamed, it's not happy, um, but... At other points along the tendon, it's a very healthy tendon. It's just a capsule. So he injected it basically. Well, I went somewhere else and got it injected with local anesthetic. It wasn't very pleasant, obviously. Someone injecting a needle into your ankle joint. Fun times. To do all the things I couldn't do. And train on it and do everything I want, which is great. So then we know what the real issue is. Evidence of an injection right there. Think on what happens. Will depend on possibly another surgery though, which I'm really not looking forward to. <laughs> Here's me really opening up to you guys, and people may judge me for this, but <coughs> I'm definitely getting sick. I can talk about my ankle and everything. Jeez, it, it makes me still so upset. And like that, I spent like two hours at the hospital today. I was just very emotionally draining, not gonna lie. What I really feel like for dinner is soup. Pumpkin. Oh, pumpkin soup. Funny I say that, it's like October. I don't know why I would have gotten sick though. Good morning everyone, it's now Thursday. I'm just hitting the gym. Oh, I feel like I start every vlog like that. I got up really late this morning. I got up at like 10, which is terrible because I'm usually someone who really prioritizes their sleep. But to be honest, if I spend time with my boyfriend, I actually like, lose track of time and I forget like that I have a bedtime and that I need to go and sleep so I actually had a bit of sleep catching up to do and I got almost like 12 hours so I feel amazing hope you guys enjoyed this video and got something out of it something that also just like ran through my mind this morning was like people need to spend less than they save and often when people have more money they think because they have more they can spend more but that's just like so stupid. You never know when a rainy day is gonna come. So just be conscious with your money and remember that the materialistic things, they might make you feel good for like one second or a day or a week, but they definitely will never fulfill um, you know, yourself and make you feel happiness long-term. It's the things you do every day. It's the people that you spend your time with and it's your outlook and your it's honestly your mind state and mindset at the end of the day. Um, but yeah, anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. My hair looks crazy. It needs to go up.